I think in my experience, you know, this, this is the first one of these types of events and actually there's not many events around the world where parliamentarians in particular have had the opportunity to interact in this type of forum with service providers, with experts, with diaspora members in particular to understand the issue. I think it's a start to opening a dialogue. diaspora is an important contributor and an enabler to actually make them serious operational implementation partners. And IOM, of course, has this global footprint and the legitimacy as, as an organization that's been working on these issues, you know, to, to sort of launch these things and bring them to scale. So I, I, as a general thing, I absolutely think it makes sense. Some of the technological elements um, that I think are changing the, the way we think about migration, some of the policies, the possibilities, the practices uh, of migration. So one way through blockchain, and I think there's, uh, there's been a lot of progress made um, in using blockchain both for financial transactions to reduce the cost of remittances. In terms of projects, we are uh, at the moment uh, planning uh, to have uh, a kind of network which could uh, link all Syrian businesses together, not only in one country but all over the world. Working with the diasporas here, they're the most influential people in selling the benefits for diasporas of working with governments and parliamentarians as well.